Hey Cheekies, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to the first video of 2024. Hope you're having a really wonderful start to the new year. Let's just start it off with a good old fashioned haul video. And we have a little guest, which is April, our new puppy. She is actually gonna be three months on Monday. And she has been just absolutely wonderful. If you're new here, I'm Christine. This channel is dedicated to all things beauty, fashion, lifestyle, vlogs. If that's something that might interest you, would really appreciate it if you could please subscribe. I did end up picking up a whole bunch of things for April. I'm gonna try to get some b-roll of her wearing the items so you can kind of get an idea and see if this might be a fit for you for your pet. But April is actually, she's really tiny. She is a she poo. She's half shih tzu, half a uh, toy poodle and she's not going to get that much bigger. She has grown quite a bit since the time that we adopted her. Let's just first start with the harness because the harness is freaking cute. Hi honey. I mean look at that. It says juicy on it right so this is what it looks like this is the back of course it's velour it also has a patty so it's not going to dig into her skin it's pretty comfortable for her when we first adopted her it was just way too big her legs were just slipping right out of it this goes underneath and you just loop it right through here it has a little buckle so you can actually adjust the straps on the side which is really good also have the leash which of course it is also velour it is quite heavy and this clasp is metal you can also put it around your wrist we do use this here at home because it is slightly like a little bit too large for her but when she gets a little bit bigger she'll be able to use it uh, when we go out. Doesn't complain when she has to wear it, especially when she's downstairs, because as much as we would love to have her just kind of roam around the house, she's still in the potty training mode. Oh, she has hiccups. Uh, so accidents are gonna happen and there have been quite a few. April just received her second vaccination yesterday so she still has one more to go before she can actually go out and step foot in the outside world because for now she's been in her bag which i'll have to show you her bag juicy couture has some really cute pet toys it's extra if you compare it with ones that you can find in the store it's just a couple dollars more if you want to make your pet really juicy this is a good way to go it's a pet tennis ball set the other one is downstairs. I don't know where it is right now. The other one is in her car seat. It does say juicy. There's a lighter pink, this brighter bubblegum pink. Also another tennis ball that's black. The other one, which I haven't opened yet because it is kind of big for her size, uh, but we'll probably let her play with it now. Squeaky toy pet. And it's a cherry with a little bow on top of it and it does say juicy it's in a really pretty blush pink this part right here is gold you hear that honey size comparison to april it is kind of like a big toy for her she is a very chill calm dog she loves um affection attention if you want her to like sit in your lap more like a lap dog she's very calm um She's trying to bite on the mic right now. The times I've taken her out, which has been quite a bit, she goes around with me practically everywhere, the gym, the store, restaurants. I feel very blessed to have her as part of the family. And my parents who have never been like into dogs or pets in general, they adore her. My mom is terrified of dogs. It could be the smallest, cutest little dog. She's actually known in our neighborhood as Ollie who's scared of dogs. Yeah, she absolutely adores April. Has picked her up, she's petted her, and she's always checking in on her, as well as my dad. Let's move on, we still have other things 
to share. You know Juicy Couture is known for their velour tracksuits. Now they do have two different styles. There's one that's an actual, it looks like a jumpsuit type of thing, but because she's so small, wasn't sure if it was gonna fit her. This is in a size extra small, April. Probably now she would fit into it, but at the time when we took pictures, it was still too big for her because uh, one leg would actually come out of this. It's a really adorable um, Juicy Couture velour hoodie and on the back of course it says juicy with these little rhinestones it's super cute very very reminiscent of what you would see on a juicy couture velour tracksuit it does have um a hole in the back if your pet does wear a collar she's just making a whole bunch of noise when i saw this i was like girl we just need to be twinning besties with this this next item i just thought it was so freaking adorable it's a juicy couture placemat and it says give me treats it's shaped like a bone uh the material it's wipeable but say if your pet spills water on it it does seep through so that's something to note because uh, when her water spilled it seeped through this and then we had to of course lift up the mat and then wipe underneath it and it's a beautiful shade of pink so i'll make sure to link everything in the description box or you can also check out the youtube shop which uh, is like somewhere right here now this was like an impulse purchase i wasn't really sure about it but it was more of uh, the added accessory that was more of the selling point. A blind buy, I didn't measure it. Uh, and really, I should have. Pet blanket. It does have like that Sherpa material on the inside. It's a pretty large blanket. This is like the size of our bed and we do have a full queen. The material is really soft. It's very plush. If you see the print on it, the print on it has stars, it has the JC, and then you of course have a dog bone. Super thick. I don't think I would put this in her bag, like her dog carrier, because it is quite thick. Most likely it will be on the bed. I mean, it's pink, it's cute, and it is also warm. And it also has a paw print. So it's very, very cute. It's a fairly large blanket. The tag, which says Juicy Couture at the bottom. It also came with a little added bonus, which is a Juicy Couture dog bone pillow. It's very soft, very plush. April will actually sit underneath my desk, lay her head on top of this, or sometimes it's like beside her, kind of like cradling her like a baby. Um, but it's very cute. It says uh, Juicy Couture on the tag. And then on the back, it does have like a paw print. Out of everything, she could care less about the blanket. She loves the pillow. So I would highly, highly recommend the pillow. I kept searching and searching for the perfect pet carrier, the perfect dog carrier, because I'm not very tall. I didn't want it to be super bulky. I knew I wanted it to be pink. That's like what I was looking for. I ended up finding this one oh i'm sorry and it is absolutely freaking adorable it says um give me treats love dogs uh born to bark in the glamorous usa super adorable it's got the two dogs on the front this right here that it's not um embossed which i wish it would have been embossed so that's the only downside eventually it might rub off faux suede material it's very soft the details on this are perfection it has uh gold details the j of course you also have the juicy couture charms for the zippers and the hardware it's all gold mesh windows for the front and the back are shaped like a heart which is very adorable right it's very very cute you love your juicy bag right honey and then when you open it the interior has the classic juicy couture uh dogs and it does zip you can unzip this all the way just to show you let me show you once it's fully unzipped when you fully unzip it it can lay flat which is pretty dope lay completely flat see i just keep um 
a soft plush blanket in here for her because if I don't put a blanket in here when I'm carrying the bag around she's kind she just gets tossed around in the bag because she's that small so I put the blanket all the way in the back just so that she's more towards the front and then I just have another one at the bottom excuse me honey I have like a little pad on this but it also has a removable insert which is made of like that faux suede and then this you can wash it just in case you know if she, they have an accident or something it is a little bit difficult to take out this cardboard it is what keeps the bag structured we're at the gym she loves putting both of her paws out with her head sticking out and she just chills like she will just sit there if not you know she goes to sleep in the bag she's a really good chill dog she's very curious about the outside world and you know what everybody's doing what are all the sounds that she hears the handles are really really good quality since the logo is only on the left side it doesn't have it on the other side it's just completely plain and I'm right-handed I'm more comfortable carrying a bag on my right shoulder so you can't really see the logo at all so i wish that they had put it on both sides that would have been like an added bonus if they did that it's not juicy couture but it's juicy couture it's for the decadent dog moisturizing conditioner i did use it on her yesterday and let me just tell you when i saw the packaging i was like oh my gosh this is so cute box is very cute reminiscent of juicy couture packaging is also very cute looking right it doesn't smell like juicy couture but it does smell very very good like i'm telling you your pet will smell freaking amazing because she smells like a juicy girly she smells amazing and i read the reviews on this product and so many people had nothing but positive things to say about it it also just really depends how your pet handles the fragrance because they can be sensitive to it but luckily april is not there's one more item which is a little bit too large for me to actually show you it's a juicy couture mat and it's the same color pink and brown it's got the dog on it. it says juicy couture she seems to really like it because she'll like lay down on it she kind of just chills on there and she also plays our room is carpeted so this is like a nice way for her just to play around and it also covers the area i do put pee pads underneath it just in case if she has an accident cute but you can tell that it's a knockoff juicy couture rug it's not like an authentic one so when you look at the quality of it it's not the best the material is kind of like those um quick absorbent drying mats non-slip rubber underneath um that's what it does feel like it's very soft it's exactly what i was looking for and it also gives that added protection since we do have carpet all right chickies so i think that is it for our first haul of 2024 please let us know if you have picked up any juicy couture pet items pet accessories if you have any recommendations on stuff because i'm on the hunt for things for her i don't want to go too overboard i think that this is enough but you never know as always thank you so much for hanging out with us if you enjoyed this haul video with april please make sure you give it a like subscribe if you have not already would love for you to be a part of the cheeky crew have an amazing wonderful day and we will see you in the next video Mwah.